Hey, Curl Friends, hey. Oh my goodness, so I am back. But in all fairness, this is not, <laughs> this is not how, this is not a true representation of how my hair progressed from yesterday to today. Dang, I got a juicy mouth today. Let me, okay. My goodness, it was just juicy. Okay, so this is not a true representation of what my hair progressed to. What do I mean by that? What I mean is I've been playing all of my hair. I've been fluffing it. I've just been, I don't know why. And I wasn't thinking about the fact that I needed to tape or whatever because I've just been going in and doing this and massaging my scalp because that just feels so good. Oh my goodness. And just going like this and stuff. So I didn't think about the fact that I needed to tape and show you guys what it was going to look like. So here it is, but it's not, you know, this is not what it looked like. So anyways, this is where we are. We're going to jump in the shower. It is officially day four. We're going to do it one more again, and then we're going to call this a wrap. And I'm going to come back. I'm going to give you my pros and my cons to it and just let you know my true thoughts about everything and yeah so i will see you here shortly i just want to see something i want to see how easy or not it would be to be able to get a brush through my hair i've just been finger detangling this tends to be the part of my hair that tangles up like quite a bit because it's finer and it just gets kind of crazy sometimes, so let's see. I know you lying. I know you lying. <laughs> there ain't no way. Compared to how it normally is, this is like nothing. That is wild. Okay. Wow. One more section, one more. My hair just doesn't detangle that easy anymore. Not, wow. I mean, after finger detangling, like I would expect for it to have been way more intense but my hair just breaks apart rather easily. Sometimes there are some additional, you know, knots and stuff, but wow. Okay, well, we got the answer to that. I don't know what else to say because I'm just like, wow. Okay, wow. <laughs> we y'all can see this, but do you see the hair that I lost each day versus ooh, this big amount of hair when I brushed it? And like, the brush is a great brush, but just, I mean, your hair is at its weakest point, you know, when it's wet. And this just told me so much. And I don't feel like I would have lost all this hair. Like, I don't feel like this is like true shed hair that was meant to come out. I feel like it was hair that because I was brushing through, you know, it was just snatching and grabbing. It's not like I didn't know that, you know what I mean, before, but just doing this experiment and then seeing it and feeling it, I was like, duly noted. Okay, duly noted. so let's talk about the hair. So as we take it down, um, we're gonna, actually I'm not gonna turn around and do all that. I made sure that I took my time and put plenty of product in it unlike yesterday because I think I'm going to try and wear this set for two to three days to see how it lasts. Do you guys want me to go over the pros and the cons now or after this sets to where you can really see it and then we talk about it? Okay, stop. I heard you. Oh my gosh. I feel like I can hear y'all. Well, we want to see We want to see it first and then you can come back and then you do it so we can get a good look because we nosy and we want to see all the things. So, okay. I will do it that way. I will do it that way. I heard you. I mean, I didn't hear you, but I feel like I'm hearing you. 
I feel like I'm hearing you. What you talking about, Willis? I'm loving the curl clumps. I'm loving how it looks. Okay. And then, oop. I, I was kind of snatching and grabbing with that. I need to slow down, Shelly. Slow down. Here we are. All right, so we're gonna go sit under the dryer and then we will be back and we will talk about the pros and the cons and if I will continue this and what my thoughts are and just all the good little nosy, rosy things. Okay, I'll be back. So this wash and go here is from day four of doing the Anthony Dickey method. I did this on Friday. It is now Monday morning so you can see she is beautiful. I purposefully pushed it out three days just because I wanted to see how it would last and look. Absolutely gorgeous. So today I am going to be washing my hair and I'm going to be using his product. It's Hair Rules and it's his No Suds Cleansing Cream. You're supposed to use this once a week and the rest of the time you're supposed to do co-washing um, where you're bathing your hair in a ton of conditioner. So you want to use as much conditioner as you have hair. So that's what I've been doing. So what are my overall thoughts? I have some pros and some cons to the method. Overall, I will say 